heart is beating, like my heart's literally beating out of my chest. Hey guys, I'm Lindsay Zarniak, and I'm here at the Breeders' Cup in Lexington, Kentucky, at Keeneland, the famous racetrack. I'm with my daughter. This is Sibby, and today Sibby is six, so we're celebrating her birthday, and I'm so excited to have the chance to be here with her. Um, I'm trying to turn Sib into an Uber race fan. My dad actually is the one that did that kind of for me because he was a sports journalist who covered horse racing out of the gate. There's just something that's so cool about horse racing and there's a lot that we always talk about in terms of the connection of horse racing and motorsports because that's what I got my start really in covering sports. This is actually such a cool experience for me because as a sports journalist I've, I've covered the Preakness but I've never actually been able to take it in as just average fan, right? But I don't want to use the word average because here at the Breeders' Cup, what I'm learning very fast is that this is an event like none other, not only because everybody's dressed to the nines, but also just because the caliber of competition here is so incredible. We need to get a hat, child. Are you ready to get a hat? Yeah. Are you Christine? I am Christine. Hi, I'm Lindsay. Oh, it's nice to it's meet so you. It's so good to meet you. What are you, All right. what are you thinking? Well, is, I mean, are there trends with hats each year? Or is there something that people are doing more of now? What do you recommend? I mean, I, l I would love to represent some purple because I don't have any in my outfit. This is different. This is sort of like Cinderella's stepsisters <laughs> in a great way, right? No, I think this is like oh, Cinderella cute. herself. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's really cute. Yes. I, that's so pretty. You look so pretty. What do you think? You want to look at yourself? I'm going with this one. How are you? How are you? It's so great, great to see you. you oh my goodness. Um, how are you feeling about Fight Line? I mean, are you... I mean, Lizzie, you know, it's... You try not to let your mind go there, because that's like you can only... You know, you don't know what to say. And it's like, if he runs his race, he should be okay. All right. Come on, Jackie! Look at him, Jackie. That's intense. You got you got so much dirt on your face. Yeah. I know this is common, right? What's the most exhilarating part for you being out there, just in terms of your job? I've always wondered that, you know. I would say the moment you leave the gate, it's just really uh, you go from zero to forty miles an hour, and it's just such a rush. It's awesome. Okay. Thank you. It was Thank so you. good to meet you. you well. Good so luck much. the rest of the way. I think this is awesome. I think I think it, it's like it feels like New Orleans because you've got people hanging from the balconies. And um, it's just a massive, like there's so much energy and anticipation, that's the thing. Like that's what you feel here. Which honestly, out of anything I've done, it's sort of similar to like the feeling you get at the Indy 500, but it feels different. Like this to me here feels different than other horse races I've been to, meaning the Preakness or like even watching the Derby on TV because it's there's, there's like a certain buzz. And I really think it's because of Flight Line also that there's so much more, you know, people like anticipation. <laughs> Doing here? <laughs> oh my God! It's so good to see you. I've never been here, and it's um, yeah. This reminds me of the Indy 500. Like, have you done that ever? You guys should do that. You guys should. It's on. It's on the list. Do that on the tour. Are you gonna do you gonna interview the horse or what? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. There he is. I saw his rear side, but it, it looks very speedy. So <laughs> it's just cool. It's cool to be part of a sporting event that brings together so many people. And also, like, the international feel here is different. I, it's really cool. I feel like I'm going to throw up now because it's so exciting. Oh, my God. They are at the post. And they're off in the Longines Breeders' Cup Classic. Here goes Hot Rod Charlie, flight line, life is good, life is good, now strikes the lead as they head past this duo, goes on past the quarter pole, into the stretch of Keeneland, and flight line just moves right by him.
Championship event, White Line has won the Breeders' Cup Classic. I know, I cry in sports. I can't, that's, my heart is beating, like my heart's literally beating out of my chest. I don't know why. Wow. I don't even know what I'm videoing. I know, like, I know he was favored, but I actually think there were probably a lot of people that thought really, really, and I, I don't even know how to describe what I just saw. That was crazy. And I obviously don't know enough about this sport, but what he did coming around that last turn, I don't know. It's crazy, but oh, here's the other thing that's crazy. I all of a sudden spotted all these like star athletes in our area, and I'm like, greatness loves greatness, and I love that, right? Like when people come out to see greatness because they just know how hard it is to achieve, and that horse just did exactly what people like wanted him to do. That's awesome, that's just awesome. Over and out. <laughs> okay.